Dickens. Uh, Nigel, where are you, old man? Better not have gotten killed. Under here. <laughs> Get out here. Are you alone? No, I brought the great mass hordes of the undead with me. Of course I'm alone. Well, it's not the undead I'm worried about, dear boy. I kind of like them. It's the normal people I can't stand. What's happened? No, don't be like that. I haven't done anything, or stolen anything, or even lied that much. What then? A bunch of people just chased me out of town. They blame me for everything that's happened. I tell you, John Larson, I've been selling health tonics for years, from here to Timbuktu, and never once has there been a, a demonic bloodlust or the undead rising up. It's preposterous. Okay. No! They want to hang me! Me! An honest salesman! Can you believe that? Snake oil merchant who cried wolf. Well, yeah, something like that. Um, well, I'm headed south. I'm, I'm headed down to Mexico. I hear things are much better down there. Not to mention the, uh, the climate and the nice locals, but uh, also the merciful lack of cannibalistic morons with infectious eye diseases. <laughs> oh. Did you uh, get the bits and bobs I requested? Sure. Ah, ha, ha. Excellent. Uh, just a moment. <laughs> okay. Uh, no, I don't want to do this. Oh, 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 oh. Ah, there. Ah, see. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Here you go. Is that a blunderbuss? Yeah. <laughs> I risked my life for this? A blunderbuss? Is this a joke? What is this, 1850? Oh, ye of such little faith. You've been hanging around cattle and killers too long. You've got the compassion of a mass murderer and the intellect of a cow patty. I'll stick your faith in this gun where the sun don't shine. This is the weapon of choice for demonic horde killers everywhere, from Romania to Edinburgh and all the other places the undead roam. You can put pretty much anything into it and blow a bunch of the buggers away in one go. Makes your rifle look like a pea shooter. You better not be lying to me. Would I lie to you, John? Yes. <laughs> I to others, I admit the occasional uh, <clears throat> sin of omission. But to you, never, dear boy. Now, uh, oh, 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 wait, wait, wait. Oh, 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 ah, yeah. Now, I am headed down to Mexico. Is there any chance that uh, I will see you there? We shall see. Well, if you're interested, I should be at Solomon's Folly in a few days, trying to figure out a way to get in. I hear the border is not as open as it used to be. <clears throat> Ta-ta! <laughs> I wonder whose fault that is. So I have a blunderbuss now. I had a cheap Good night. What? 
the heck? Okay. That's one of those weapons we don't use. All the monster weapons. Some of the monsters are higher powered in the, uh... Come on! So we should be at 38? 39. Okay, so we're 39% done. What? He's going to Mexico? Yeah! You know what? While we're over here, we have... What? He's right here. I'm gonna do the closest mission. Of course, the closest mission is, uh, again. Ah, Mr. Marston. What's going on? You got a passage into Mexico? Uh, for me, no. Uh, but for you, maybe. Uh, it all depends on your relationship with good old Uncle Samuel. What are you talking about? Well, uh, the border is indeed closed. <laughs> But the army is sending a train down there. Now, whether it's to help the Mexicans there or to escape the problems here, <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> but I thought things were better in Mexico. Uh, well, uh, better or worse, it's uh, certainly different. <laughs> so why am I going and not you? Ah, well, that's a matter of age, dear boy. The army don't have many recruits with quite my level of experience. <laughs> so... So, you are on your own. <laughs> There's a train at uh, Benedict Point, and it's leaving soon once they've got all of the soldiers rounded up. Okay. And uh, your venerable friend here has done some more help. I have found some less than happy campers who have given up on glory and abandoned Uncle Sam's ranks. Uh, they're hiding out at Scratching Post. One of them might give you a uniform. <laughs> okay. What about you? Ah! Baghdad, dear boy! <laughs> well, either that, or Fort Mercer, or perhaps it's time to meet my maker with drool coming out of my mouth and the lust for human blood. <laughs> <laughs> you take care of yourself. I always do, dear boy. Looks 
your hand, Colonel! You think you can outfight a soldier? Come on! You owe me, lady. <laughs> Yo! 